Oh, this is an all-in for Ole. Wow, it's against San, San Martino as well. These two guys were pretty deep stacking. You can see the pile of 25k chips all in the middle. Already in the middle. Queen high. A couple of sevens on there. No flushes, no straights. Huge amount of chips in the middle. Button versus big blind. Shemi has shoved the river. People I'm familiar with, Ole Shemion on Twitch, are sort of judging his poker skills based on his fashion sense. Do not go down that road. This guy is the prodigy. There's lots of discussion about what's the point of a sleeveless hoodie if you wear it over a sleeve top. He can do whatever he wants, yeah? It's just been knocked off the top spot of the GPI rankings for the first time in over a year, I think. Still, just go and have a look at his Hendon Bob. So I think I'll let Shemi and Hendon Bob into any search engine. It'll come up, and you'll see a 22 year old who's won almost everything there is to win in the last few years. And the year before he came on tour, oh, he just won the TLB on yeah. Focus Stars as an 18 year old. That's all. Steve That's Bartley there. Let's have a look at the state of his pad. Yeah, it hasn't been ruined. One of the corners is a bit. Folded over. Tough decision for Dario San Martino. He's never been in this position before where he's had a 200k bubble to, to worry about just around the corner. Shemian's been here. He's done it. Somebody's arguing with me that it isn't a sleeveless hoodie. It, it, it is. Clearly. It is. It is. He, he got quite rude with me, but I'm afraid. It's a hoodie over a, big, over a top. Big Betty, it's, it is a sleeveless top. Believe me, we've been looking at this sleeveless top for some years now. We we know. He busted out at the beginning of the season season ten, I think, in Barcelona, didn't he? Yeah, I think you're right. And then he wore it without the top underneath. I don't think staring at the side of his face is going to give you much information. What? Did he just call the clock? So Ali's got about 1.1 million, and San Martino's got 456, 57, 58, 59, 51, 50. Yeah, they've both got around about the same amount of chips. I don't think there's that many chips in the middle, so I think this is a larger than pot size bet. I mean, there is a lot of chips in the middle, but. I don't think there's 1.2 million in there. Thirty seconds. Big Betty says we're even now. I've annoyed you. You've annoyed me, mate. I don't even get close to annoyed when I'm doing this job. Water off a duck's back, as you can probably imagine after this. He calls, years. He calls, he calls him massive pot. You see both hands. Wow. He, wow, he, I think. Ollie got, seems a little. Jax, Sarah Jax. Wow, and Ollie really seems stunned by how long it took him to call yeah, that. Yeah, he's saying it's a nit roll, but this is, you've got to remember this is a 200,000 euro bubble. Mm -hmm. Dario's never been in this position before. That is a monster pot. What is, I must admit, what, I, what really is Dario yeah. worried about there? He's only releasing to pocket queens, right? Oh, pocket, pocket sevens. sevens and pocket queens. Uh, only two hands is losing to. But as you said, this is a 200,000 euro bubble. Put yourself in that position. We didn't see how the action went down. It's better to take your time and make sure. If this was a 50 pound or 50 euro tournament, then I think, yeah, that's a proper nit roll, but... Wow. Oli, but you can understand Oli still being upset. Especially when you've, you've had to call the clock on someone to call with their monster. Just a boat, just a jack full of sevens. Yeah, Matt's asking what are they saying. We don't have the players at the outer table mic'd up. I'm not sure, but I think you can guess the sentiment. One million and ninety-five thousand. 
just under 1.1 million. Shemian is absolutely decimated. Wow. A lot of reaction to that on the uh, the Twitch. Everyone's screaming about the slow roll. But as you say, a slow roll it kind wasn't of... A, it wasn't a slow roll. If it was anything, it was a nit roll. Yeah, a slow roll, it kind of dictates someone did it deliberately, whereas that, I think, was a nit roll where just somebody who perhaps isn't always finding themselves in this position just can't so easily go, yeah, bang. Certainly got to be a bit paranoid to, to be particularly worried about it. But I guess the Queen's fall, it's, it's one hand you could worry about, but it is only one hand you could worry about. Ole looks sick and angry, says Queen B. I think that's a fair description. Oh. See, now after we've seen that, oh. that's a bit. That's not good. I don't like that. I'm not a big fan of that. Yeah, I've forgotten that happened. I'm starting to... Uh side of Ole a little bit more here yeah that's not that's not great I'm not a big fan of the waving hands in front of facing and then showing monster that's that's kind of like are you bluffing are you bluffing <laughs> 